Hello, hello, e Yashin 210 VTAL owners. Uh, as many of you know, these have a problem with motors not starting and uh, failing to stop. This video is to show you all why and give you some information that may help you fix the problem. Here I've bypassed the flight controller. I'm sending a signal straight into the servos. When I turn my uh, transmitter on, I'll notice that only one of the motors is starting. Yes, I know it's not spinning fast because all the props are loose and they're backwards for safety. And again, I bring it down. So here we've got the typical thing. The props fail to start the other ones. Bring it, hold it down a bit harder. And then that release, so all of them go. And the other one will start too. I'll put the throttle up. This is the actual problem is the actual throttle position to activate these is right on the threshold of uh, minus 100%. Now if I go into the setup, I'll just reset this for safety at this point, even though I'm not really in much danger, these props aren't going to hurt me. I'll just change my endpoints for channel 3, which is a throttle, down to minus 120%. Now what will happen is, if I bring the throttle up, they all start at the same time. I know you probably don't believe me those props are safe, so I'll show you. They're just loose. So there is the problem, is that the actual Lightning uh, BL Heli um, ESCs on this particular Airsheen 210 Vital are set with the, um, the throttle zero position at minus 120% rather than minus 100% as is normally the case. And that's why people are having trouble with their motors not starting or starting up or continuing to run even after they've turned the throttle off. I hope this can help somebody to get the Rishin V10 Vital flying again.